What is up everybody? This is the Wardface and we are back playing some more of The Walking Dead. Um, this is episode 2. Uh, if you haven't seen the first part, you should probably watch it and or turn this off now because I'm about to say some spoilers. Um, so unfortunately, uh, where we left off, we just had to put down Nick. Um, he had gotten shot during the like runaway from uh, uh, Carver, is that his name? Carver's place and uh, he was a walker and he was stuck on a fence. And we also got a cool... Uh, like screwdriver from Jane that we're gonna use to like shiv zombies instead of our massive axe that's on the screen. Okay, so we're just gonna jump back in. Uh, I just had to kill Nick again. <laughs> it was, uh, it made me go back to like the previous checkpoint or whatever. Clock is ticking. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm trying to make like a more badass Clementine. We need to get a better look. I'm gonna try to stand up to the zombies. How about you get the close one, and I'll hop the fence to get the other. Sounds good. Go for it. What can I do, Sarah? <laughs> Come on, you gotta hit him in the head. Yeah. Nice work. You know what you're doing. Now watch this. Well, I mean, we could have oh, saved a lot a of nice time. Little addition to your arsenal. We're getting good training from Jane, I think. Take out the knees first, then put a knife in the back of its head when it's down. We're gonna kill All right, it. let's get a look at what we've got on deck. Okay, just calm down. It's gonna take some work to get over there. There's only two of them, though, right? Let's run over to the car first. Oh! We didn't check him. We're always supposed to check him. That's why we stabbed the other ones in the head. I should have looked down. I wonder if you can... Okay, A works for that too. That's good. You did the knee thing. Nice trick, huh? Yeah. What are you doing? Why are you doing this? Holy crap. That's a lot of walkers. They look worked up about something. And we what gets the interest of the dead? People. How do we get in? If we can make enough noise on this side, we can lure those walkers over here. Then we might just be able to go through that what other trailer and get to, to your friends. What do you think of that? Sounds like a plan. I think that's best. I'm with you. Good. What's going to grab their attention? Flatulence? I got you covered. I'm guessing the horn? Yeah, it does look pretty strong. I don't think I'm going to punch it. Oh, the guy with the mullet. Oh, no. He doesn't care. I feel like it's very obviously the car horn. But I want to check out the area. Anything in the truck bed? No. Okay. Let's let, let's not make Sarah and uh, Luke wait any longer. Not like this. You can't do this. Come on, mullet guy. Damn it, don't do this. What? Why don't they care? It's good, but we need to keep it going somehow. Is there anything we can put on the horn? There must be. Oh my god, Sarah, shut your face, please. We can get around this way. We don't get those walkers to move. We're not getting very far. How do we keep the horn going then? Is there something we can do in here? There must be something we have to put on there, right? I can't get over there. 
I can't go over here any further. Oh. Anything in there? Does he have anything? Car key, maybe? What are you thinking? Did you, uh, make sure? Who do you think you're talking to? Well, you didn't make sure the other one that grabbed me, you know. Okay. A good instinct. No, put him in the put him in the car. Don't back out of that menu. What are you thinking? If we lean him on the horn, it'll keep honking and draw the walkers. Just like moths to a flame. Give me a hand. Why are you letting like the twelve-year-old figure everything out for you? Come on. Oh, this guy's heavy. We should have gotten lighter one. Come on, mullet walker. It's working. Come on. Can we like stab him through the fence? I don't like it how it keeps zooming in on that one walker. Behind you. Kick out the knees. Boom. That is a cool trick. Come on. What? Crap. We gotta move it. Where did he go? Why did the walker disappear? It's locked. Then try something else. Hey, are you guys in there? I don't think that's getting through to them. I'll hold them off. Just get us in there. Oh wow. Sometimes you can, you have the power to kick a door in? Congratulations. I don't think I could do that. <laughs> Hello? Are you in here? Help me block this. Hurry. Where's a uh, Sarah and Luke? Clem? Oh, thank God. We came to find you. Did Nick find you? He made a run for it. Looking for help. I... I saw him outside. Look, he was out there. But we took care of him. You know. Fuck. Fuck. Well, I mean, maybe I you don't... I banging through the door. Are you alright? I thought the walkers come to take what's left of us. Luke, are you alright? I'm, uh, I'm walking. Can't do much else, though. Sarah... She's another story. I'll talk to her. I... I don't know what to do about her. What's the matter? Was she bit, or is she just insane? You gotta help. I'm guessing she's just insane. Sarah, look. Look, it's Clem. See, it's just like I told you, that they're okay. Sarah, come on. We... we have to go now. What's she doing? Can you get up? I don't know what to do. I can't snap her out of it. Okay, I tried to carry her, but I, I guess Carver messed me up pretty good back there. <sighs> I don't know. It was just after Carlos, she just lost it. Started running through the woods like a maniac. I, I chased her for I don't know how long, and then while well, she saw this mobile home, made a beeline right for it. I'm just glad y'all are here. Yeah, we can't we can't just Not stick around though. Yet. What are we gonna do about her? Come on, Clint. Or Sarah. We gotta do something. Maybe she'll listen to me. Maybe. Listen, I, uh, they're gonna tear this place open pretty soon. We can't stay, so we, we gotta get her up, or, or we gotta... Jane, not the right time. I'm trying. I've been trying for hours. I can barely get her to look at me. Clem? It's up to me. Sarah, I lost my parents. Sarah, it's me. Hi. Hello. No! <laughs> Hi. Shit. It's okay. I 
I know how you feel right now. It's one of the worst feelings in the world. Ever since the walkers, so many people I know have died. People I love, and for stupid reasons. Crap, we're surrounded. Yes, we are. What? What about the skylight? Oh, we got. Clem, there's no time. Well, too bad. Clem. Listen, Jane might be right. When everything started, I met my friend Lee. He tried to help me find my parents. He protected me more than anyone else in my whole life. He died to keep me safe. I was so scared. But you're still here. Because he taught me to be strong, even when I'm scared. Because he wanted me to live. And your dad protected you because he wanted you to live. You would still want that. Come on, Sarah, you gotta get up. Get to the skylight! Now! Come on, I'll push you. Clementine, the motivational speaker. What's going on back there? My ribs. We're gonna need something to stand on. Luke, get over here. Help me hold this. You just couldn't even hold me up. Clem, see what you can find. No crate. Can we use this? It's not big enough. Okay, come down. Refrigerator? The fridge. Forget it. That thing ain't budging. Find something else. Can we use that? Yeah, that would work. What? Oh, shit. <laughs> we gotta be quick. Okay, ready? On three. One. Two, three. Come on, Luke. I know you have broken ribs, but we gotta hurry up. Clem, Clem, help her. Help Jane. Okay, go, go. Keep pushing. Go. Come on. It's getting crazy, Jane. Watch out. Jane's actually pretty badass, so... Come on! Watch out for that one crawling one. Luke, you first. We need you up top. Sarah, okay, come, on. come on. Clem! Sarah, we have to go! Are you listening? I can't do it. Yes, you can. Now, Clementine! If she doesn't want to go, you can't make her. Don't let her take you down, too. Not again. Shut up, Jane. I can't! I can't! I can't! Daddy! Sarah, think about what you're doing. You can't save her, Clem. We have to go. Believe me, I know about this. Hurry up! Is that what happened to your sister? Uh, oh, move! <laughs> Come on, Sarah. Clementine, did I do it? Grab her. Uh oh, did I just kill Jane? Uh, oh, I, I could have sworn I killed Jane there. We gotta go. <laughs> Sarah. Come on. Oh, I can't believe that worked. I saved Sarah. I did it. Pretty intense. <laughs> I'm actually pretty happy. I I could have sworn that that was gonna be like, if you convince Sarah, Jane would have had to stick around and then she dies, or Sarah just dies anyway. But I saved them. I saved both of them. Oh, well, I saved Sarah at least. Which I mean, it's probably gonna like kill me in the end, but still. Uh, uh, okay. Look, I hate to ask this, but. Are we there yet? <laughs> Does it look We're like not it? Far. You did good getting out of there. Now you gotta keep it up. But I'm not okay. It doesn't matter. Just don't let me down. Please. We gotta toughen her up. She just needs a little time, Clem. Leave her be for a bit. 
You're the one who wanted to leave her in the stupid thing. Are you kidding me? I don't know about this. The way she is, she's gonna cause problems. People will be happy to see her, though. What happened in there? When we went in there, you were ready to help, but then something changed. All she cares Look, about is herself. I just, I'd seen that kind of thing before. I just didn't want to stick around for the bitter end. Sorry, I... I don't mean to sound harsh. Does that mean you'd turn on me if I was hurt or something? No. I mean... Probably. Clem, I wouldn't have to. And just because you got her out of there today doesn't mean you saved her. Trust Actually, it does, I think. I tried to save Jamie too, but she gave up. Are you sure? Maybe you just blame yourself for that. What's up? I just... I can't believe it. As soon as you guys said go, I was the first one up on the roof. Like I had already made up my mind. You were hurt. Luke, you can't let it eat away at you. You have, like, broken ribs. You weren't probably going to be much help down there anyway. Well, I can't forget it. I dragged my sister across four states. And every morning, she'd say she wasn't getting up. So I'd convince her. Or push her. Or goddamn carry her if I had to. Until this time... Walkers cornered us. Forced us up to the roof. And, and when they kept coming, I... I couldn't make her jump. Couldn't throw her. So I tried something else. I told her she could have what she wanted. And I left her there. Wow. Jumped to the next building over by myself. You left your sister? Did she get turned? Do you know? When she didn't follow me over, I didn't have the guts to go back and see for myself. You can't let people turn. It killed me for a long time. But I finally realized that I'd put her on a forced march through hell. When all she really wanted was for me to let her go. Sarah was that way too. Jane? No regard for her own safety. Or ours. Sarah and Jamie aren't the same person. We don't know if she'll end up like that. People don't change. Come on, Jane. You're negative Nancy. Or negative Jane. Come on. Let's get back to your friends. She's so She takes like the pessimistic approach to everything. I mean, I, I understand we're in the zombie apocalypse. But still. Come on. You gotta look on the bright side every once in a while. Where's that Kenny? Why are you, why are you missing an ear? Son of a bitch. You found him. Were you always missing an ear? Yeah, I'm a little amazed myself, to tell you the truth. If it weren't for Clem and Jane, well, I don't know what would have happened. Did she baby? Sarah, how you doing, hon? That's okay, sweetie. Whenever you're ready. I'm just glad you're here. But wait, wait. Where's Nick? You know where Nick is. Uh, Rebecca, how about we, uh, we go for a walk for a minute? Let's just give him some space. I have something I need to talk to you about, too. No. No. Oh. <laughs> we lost so many people in that I ain't gonna sugarcoat stupid this. escape. That baby's coming even faster than Rebecca's letting on. But I was hoping you might know. Does Luke know anything about baby? How would I know that? Has he, I don't know, mentioned Carlos teaching him anything? Kenny does. Kenny had a family. He could help. Where is he? He went in there after you left. Said he needed a minute by himself. I ain't seen him since. I don't think he's doing well. I don't know if I should go in there. I'm afraid I've he's gonna get mad at me again. Before. That's why I was thinking... Oh, talk again? I think if it's just you, someone he knows well, you might be able to get through. I don't know. And I wouldn't ask you to do it if it weren't for the baby. <sighs> oh, this is gonna be so awkward. Kenny hates me. I killed his wife, practically. Well, if you think about it, when Lee had to put down a uh, duck, that was kind of the same thing. Mm. 
Should we talk to him? I don't know if we should talk to him or not. Shit. No, what? Help. 